The Villisca Axe Murder House in Villisca, Iowa, is a well-known tourist attraction for ghost hunters and horror lovers alike. The site of a gruesome unsolved 1912 murder, in which six children and two adults had their skulls completely crushed by the axe of an unknown perpetrator, was purchased in 1994, restored to its 1912 condition, and converted into a tourist destination. It costs $428 a night to stay at the old haunted home, where visitors always report strange paranormal experiences, such as visions of a man with an axe roaming the halls, or the faint screams of children. Lorson, 37, of Rhinelander, Wisconsin, was on a regular recreational paranormal visit with friends when true horror struck. His companions found him stabbed in the chest, an apparently self-inflicted wound called 911, and Lorson was brought to a nearby hospital before being helicoptered to Creighton University Medical Center in Omaha. The Montgomery County Sheriff's Office said Lorson suffered the self-inflicted injury, which is around the same time the 1912 axe murders in the house began. Lorson recovered from his injuries but has never spoken publicly about what occurred that day. For Martha Lynn, the owner of the home, the incident was very upsetting. It's publicity, but it's not exactly the kind of publicity you desire to have. I don't want people thinking that when they come to the Villisca Axe murder house, something's going to happen that's going to make them do something like that. The house remains open for tourist visits and overnight stays today.